hello children how are you guys you're all happy and fine and safe right and children in this chapter we know we studied about the respiratory system in various organism that is respiration in organism we started we continued with the cellular respiration then about the aerobic and anaerobic respiration we studied am i right okay children in this class we are going to study about the breathing okay it's very simple process which takes place in all a living organism okay what is meant by breathing means like taking in oxygen and giving out carbon dioxide is nothing but the breathing okay see you close your nostril and mouth tightly and look at the watch how long you are able to close these two and be maybe for a fraction of minute right we cannot be alive without breathing breathing is the one of the main step through which we have to follow and because of which we are alive okay breathing means taking in rich in oxygen the air and giving out the air which is rich in carbon dioxide with the help of respiratory organs okay simply we cannot take in oxygen throughout carbon dioxide we need the passage or the pathway to proceed in this that is nothing but the respiratory organs okay so taking in air rich in oxygen into the body is called as inhalation okay breathing in the air which is rich in oxygen is called as what inhalation and giving out of the air which is rich in carbon dioxide is called as exhalation is it clear taking in air rich in oxygen is inhalation giving out air which is rich in carbon dioxide is exhalation and it is the continuous process okay after one breathing in one breathing out breathing in breathing out breathing in breathing out like cycle it need to happen this process is called as breathing okay and uh, in human being the number of times we breathe per minute it is 60 i remember you guys did it in our live class yes we breathe in breathe out for a minute we were able to do it 16 times and this is called as breathing rate okay this is called as what breathing rate and also children when we do some physical activity like jumping running walking for long distance okay or climbing the stairs when we do a lot of physical activity continuously we are we are in need of lot of energy and what happens we breathe very fast okay yeah the breathing rate will be very high so you uh, in the table column 10.1 you have to do this uh, you know breathing rate a different condition normally then when you do brisk walk and after running okay and at rest what is the breathing rate you have to do it you do for yourself and check with your friends also is that clear and this is what is the breathing do you have any doubt children it's very simple taking in oxygen and giving out carbon dioxide is breathing and you have a small activity based on breathing is that clear children okay you have to fill off the table column and finish off with that okay about the breathing okay at various stage when you walk when you run when you jump okay when you are at rest you have to check and do this table column is it clear children okay and also you can take out when uh, when uh, you know um Uh, like washing the vessel wa uh, washing the clothes okay when you dance when you sleep that also you can check at various activity what is the breathing rate you have to check and fill out in the table column is it clear children okay thank you